hello, 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 Kenny Evans here. Got to walk and talk. Topic of this video is <clears throat> the only women men should be friends with. Men should, can be friends with. Before I get into this topic, <clears throat> I definitely want to let y'all know how this channel is all about helping both men and women be the best they can be in all aspects of their lives. Health, wealth, dating relationships, and mindsets. I appreciate y'all being here. New people, new viewers, welcome. Returning viewers, welcome. I appreciate y'all being here. Of course, if you haven't already done so, um, hit the subscribe button, hit that notification button so you'll be notified whenever I upload new, some new videos. Of course, like the video. That'll be always good. Helps out with the algorithm. Of course, if you just want to support the channel, that's all good. <clears throat> Of course, let's share this video so we can get it out to more people who uh, could use this information. So I appreciate y'all being here. I really do. Um, <clears throat> of course, I'm going to talk about uh, four of the uh, things to really look out for for women who could be your friends as a man, a strong man. And then the bonus at the end. Definitely want to stay to the end for the bonus. You know. Um, <clears throat> and all that good stuff. So. Because. <coughs> excuse me. Men and women generally aren't friends. But it's not off limits completely. There has to be. Certain things to look for. For women. As a man in order for her to be your friend. You know what I mean? So, um, we'll definitely talk about those. Maybe some new ones, maybe some old ones you've heard. It's going to be an interesting conversation nonetheless. <clears throat> but, let's get into this topic at hand. The only women, men, could, should, can, be friends with. All right. First and foremost, the most important thing is understanding that um, you're not attracted to them. It should be women who you are not sexually attracted to. Because if they're who you are sexually attracted to and you are not attempting to either sleep with her, date her, do anything with her sexually or romantically, then you are in the friend zone. And that is not what we're talking about. We're not talking about <laughs> friend zoning yourself. You know what I mean? Friend zoning yourself is an issue. So, first and foremost, women, this is the main thing. You have to be, or you can be friends with women who you're not sexually attracted to. Because if you're, again, friends with the woman who you're sexually attracted to, and you're not having sex or doing anything with them, romantic, or pursuing the act of sex or relationship, then you're friend zone. And that's where we, we don't get you. <laughs> we don't want to get you friend zone, all right? So, that's the first, first thing to look out for. Make sure it is women who are not sexually attracted to, all right? Number two, it could be a woman who you've dated before and you no longer have any interest in. That's another one too. Because maybe you dated her and maybe you found her sexually attractive at first, but y'all dated and y'all realize y'all are better as just friends. You're not interested in her anymore, you know, and you rather just keep it more platonic. There's nothing wrong with that either. You know, as long as it's a woman who you're just not sexually interested, you don't want to be wanting to have sex with her, but she doesn't want to have sex with you. You know, because then obviously again you're in the friend zone. Well, we don't want that. We don't. We don't want you to be in the friend zone. Uh, let me go back here. So <clears throat> that's the number. The second rule: a woman who you 
you might have dated in the past who you have no more interest in. And the number three. Ah, yeah, I gotta find somewhere to sit. A little, a little phone hurt my little shoulder. Just lifting it up like that. So, it's all good. It's gonna get stronger. But yes, number three is all about um, women who are wing with you. So, women who help you get other girls. And again, of course, you are not sexually attracted to them and that's the first and foremost you can't it doesn't matter what these women are to you because if you're sexually attracted to them and you constantly wanted to get with them but you can't again you friend zone so women who you are not sexually attracted to who help you get other women you know what i mean you all can relate maybe she could be a lesbian you know what i mean maybe I, you know but y'all um she helps you get girls for whatever reason you know, <clears throat> um, yeah, that on that helps you get girls. The wing woman, you know, helps you get girls. So I appreciate y'all being here this long into the video. If you have not already done so, definitely subscribe, hit that notification button so you'll be notified whenever I upload some new videos. Definitely like the video if you're liking it so far, share the video so we could uh, get this video out to. Uh, people who need this video so it can make this world a better place for us and our future generations. You know what I mean? I definitely appreciate y'all. You know, um, obviously I just put this time for make these videos a week to help y'all out, help you make your life a little and get an understanding what's going on out here in the world. You know, so I appreciate y'all being here for uh, with me and uh, being along for the ride for this long. Yeah. Uh, let's see. Gotta find a place to pop a squat. Uh, 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 uh. Uh, work. But yeah. But yes. Let's get uh, get on with the video here. So definitely, um, you know, wing women are important. They're very important help you get girls you could you could relate to that girl on that level so but uh outside of that you want a woman who helps you with business a woman who helps you with business you know again it's women who you're not attracted to but maybe she has a great business acumen she has great businessmen or maybe she heard that you're trying to work with business and she she wanted to help you out you know what I mean? She wanted to help you out. And therefore she does. You know? So. All that is super important. To understand. It's all about what you are able to get. <clears throat> out of the situation. You know what I mean? So. If you're able to find women who you're not attracted to. But she, you, you have a business that you're wanting to work with or get started and she is saying oh well you know I've done like that or I have some experience in that business or I know people who have done you know that business or experience and she wants to help you and you want her to help you oh and sure um, that is granted of course again sure she'll help you with business but if you could relate out of the business then y'all could be cool on that level too all right <clears throat> So yes, last but not least, we have the bonus. Again, I appreciate being here, making it this far into the video. You know, um, uh, hopefully all the tips, tricks, you, you learn, you apply, you apply and you learn, awesome results, all right? So the bonus is, ultimately, you can be friends with women or should be friends with women who add value to your life away from a sexual attraction, all right? So again, first, yeah, you're not gonna be sexually attracted to the woman. Second, <clears throat> does she add some sort of value to your life away from the sexual attraction? You no. Know, is there something that she does? You no, know, that makes your life better, adds value, positive value to your life. 
All right, if she does not sexually attract her, you like being around her, maybe she's maybe she's intelligent, maybe she helps you with business, maybe she helps you get girls, maybe she knows people who could help you in certain areas of your life, then you can't be friends with her, should be friends with her, if you want to. All right, so <clears throat> that is all I got for y'all today. Hopefully y'all enjoyed this video, you liked, um, you, you learned a lot. Hopefully you apply what you learn. Help you get some results. Uh, definitely, <laughs> let me know whether you like my list, you dislike my list. Know if you think everything was spot on, let me know if you think I'm missing. Or simply, of course, uh, if you have not already done so, comment, subscribe, hit that notification button, and definitely share the video so we can get this video out to more people who can use information to make this world a better place for us and our future generations. All right. <clears throat> of course. Uh, let me know what are the topics you want me to talk about. I'm sure, I make this channel, I made this channel, I make these videos, but I made them for you. So I want to know what you want to, to hear about. All right. Donations are always appreciated if you found value.